Hey guys, I'm SKV and you're watching SKV Plays On and welcome to another video of Dauntless today. If you like this video, please do give it a thumbs up. And if you like it a bit more, please do subscribe to my channel. And without further ado, let me get straight to the point. This is update 1.3.6, which brings two new things into the game. One is the mini pass. It's not new. It's just the old hunt pass that's making its way back in a new way where the hunt pass used to be level 50 that you had to reach but this one is half of that which is only level 25 because of which the days you have is only 14 days that is left and uh, you can go to your mailbox after logging into the game and check the date this particular mini pass for the far slayers fall is gonna be there only up until september 17th so please check the date and time and get things done and uh, speaking about this if you go to the hunt pass screen you can see upgrade to elite track those of you who haven't got this done when the season 3 was out you can get it done now but you have to unlock it using platinum i see seems that uh, free track is still locked i think the free track also is going to be unlocked because it's not a regular uh, season of the hunt pass that's happening and they brought back something from before it seems that it may not be completely free but here's the thing if you spend whatever uh, the elite track uh, price is you may end up getting back 650 platinum from the elite and the free track there's 500 platinum in the rewards for the elite track and up in the free track you have 150 platinum so a total of 650 platinum you'll be getting back uh, for me, if I upgrade it and if I unlock it now, which I am going to, I'll be getting 650 platinum back, which is, oh, is for me, nice. who's already done all this, I'm getting a bit extra. You know what I'm saying? I'm getting a bit more extra uh, platinum, which is around probably 70 platinum extra, I think. Uh, if I'm not bad at math, which I may be. Anyways, getting to this, uh, this is the mini pass which is making a comeback. Uh, this is the season 3 pass that happened long back and it's back now. You can get all the rewards. You can check it out. The lantern skin, weapon skin, emotes and platinum and also outfits and the banner plant emotes and uh, that one they need to fix that. That thing kind of looks like it's shivering when it's getting out and of course the outfit transmogs you can get it once you reach level 25 this is only there up until 17 september 2020 so you got 14 days from me uploading this video and whatever the date and days they've given uh so go get that done along with that there's another update which actually came with the 1.3.6 this probably might be the main one there's been a few changes with the particular escalation. What is it? Talent tree changes. There we go. Look at this. They have kind of reset all your escalation points. Not to zero. They've just reset the points. Those of them who finished all the escalation runs to the max. And they got all the talent points and talent tree skills unlocked. Or the amps unlocked. They have kind of introduced new amps into this i'll just show you right now you can check out the info i'll put the link in the description you can check out the info or the notes of update 1.3.6 but check this out we got new amp icons that are representing the uh, npcs in the town or in the city of ramsgate or town of ramsgate i don't know what it is town or city it's a floating island and it's ramsgate so yeah you know Strega, the potions lady, and you know uh, Lady Luck, the one related to the trials and all the rewards. Then we have Moira here. And then if you go over here to the Blaze Escalation, we got Mr. Borman. He has something. He gives These guys give some kind of amp uh, passives that uh, kind of really help out a lot. Uh, let me just show you as an example. Moira, if you unlock this icon with your talent points, mind you... You have to go in an order. I don't think you can just unlock it, see? Because it's locked. You have to spend points on the first one to be able to unlock that particular line of a tree. 
or I don't even, it doesn't look like a tree, it looks like rows and columns to me, but uh, they call it a talent tree for some reason. Anyways, uh, these don't look like branches, uh, but this is Moira, she gives you 5% damage reduction on the first level. If there are many levels on this, you can get probably 10 to 15% damage reduction, which actually is pretty good. And also, we have Strega's Tonics. These Tonics will not let you uh, kind of regenerate your Lantern or refill your Flask. But what it does give you is for that particular hunt, you'll have Lifesteal. Meaning every hit, you'll get like 1% or depending on how many levels you upgrade it, you'll get that much percent of passive Lifesteal. That's just an example. And also... They have a small teaser of an escalation amp somewhere here. I don't know where. I'm just showing you. I don't know where. Right over there. Uh, it seems that the terror escalation, which is supposed to happen in the future, uh, in the next update or something. I don't know which update, but it's gonna be coming out. They just wanted to put a little bit of a teaser. So they've given this particular terror escalation amp. The Terra Escalation is not here yet. They've just put in a small type of a teaser. Uh, just so you can unlock it and try it out yourself. I'm not going to say anything about it. Uh, you can go try it out. And also you should know. If you're using a Blaze Escalation related amp. And you've unlocked it in the so Shock Escalation. Not Sock. Shock. Shock Escalation. If you've unlocked that one. For example this one. Multi Amp Unlocked. This one is Wounded Corruption. This one has Torgodoro's face on it. Oh wait, that's... Is that Torgodoro? No, this is Torgodoro. That is Trax. Okay. Let me switch to Torgodoro. So Lady... Lady Lux Flames is Torgodoro, which is um, the Escalation... The Blaze Escalation related amp. If you're using it in Shock Escalation, what they say in the notes is that it's not gonna be of that magnitude, whatever... Uh, power and damage it does from there it's been tuned to the shock escalation whatever you use uh, that particular amp from blaze escalation if you use it in shock it'll be slightly tuned down or kind of adjusted to balance out the shock escalation related fights also along with that you will get extra abilities like torgodoro's strength and torgodoro's fury along with using this amp so pretty much you'll be having three in one type of a deal so yeah so also they say you get only 25 points you cannot get more than that but these things may have different set of uh, upgrade point requirements which may not be enough because you have to make sure you choose your favorite ones or your best ones suited to your playstyle and use up these 25 talent points so that's the new update and uh, anyways that's about it and uh, i think i'm gonna be finishing up for this particular video and as always you guys keep smiling uh please go check out the hunt pass or mini pass uh get that done it it's only gonna be there for another 14 days from now and uh it ends on september 17 2020 so yeah and also this escalation has brought some new amps into the game so try it out anyways that's about it for any more information, I'll put the uh, link in the description for the notes, patch notes and also whatever Far Slayer mini pass notes. Uh, do check it out if in case my explanation was not up to the point. Please do check out the link in the, 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 the description. Uh, and as always, you guys keep smiling and please stay safe and have a good day and all that uh, formalities that I usually do at the end of the video and uh, again eto sayonara etata i see you and yeah, bye bye i'm done with this video see ya yep see ya